morning guys welcome to today's video we are headed out early and there are some ominous clouds out there i am worried about tornadoes now who knew ontario canada and i am worried about the tornadoes living without power for a couple of days was awful but so many people well not so many but some people lost their lives some people lost their barn some people lost their houses like it was so much bigger yeah so much bigger than it just being without power so I'm not gonna complain about that for sure, but it was crazy. And add to that, we had grandkids over, and add to that, we had a party, and had to clean up from the party. Like, my house is, is, is a shambles. <laughs> but we still have the most important people in the world with us. What's up, and, Jacob? Uh, um, um, Sophie said we're leaving without you. She did? Yeah. Sophie, why did you say we're leaving Sophie without you? Joe. Oh, did it hurt your feelings, Jacob? Yeah. Toby, you gotta say sorry, Jacob. Sorry. It's okay, he said, it's okay. You gotta always be kind, guys. Even if somebody misunderstands what you're saying, sometimes it just takes a, oh, I didn't mean it that way, I'm really sorry, to make them feel better. And feelings matter, and people matter, and animals matter, and people matter too. Anyways, we're headed out to take the grandkids someplace fun, at least we hope it's fun. Sam picked this, Sam, is this gonna be fun? Let me tell you, five-year-old boys are a lot of work. So, Not lots of running. Six. Oh, six-year-old boys. <laughs> How did you turn six and I forgot? Actually, you're almost seven, aren't you? Yeah. Wow, seven-year-old boys are a lot of work. Anyway, hopefully Sam is taking us someplace fun. Uh, we're gonna drive there, and while we're there, while we're driving, I'm gonna show you guys all the stuff that we did last night because we had no power. Oh, we got power, I forgot to tell you guys that. We got power. We came home last night. So last night we went out to do some stuff and to eat some food because we didn't have any power and it was freezing cold, rained all day, it was just awful. And then we came home and when we were in the car, I said, who thinks we have power? And Brooklyn said, I don't. And Sophie said, I don't. And Gabby said, I don't. And Jacob said, I do. And I said, I'm right there with you, Jacob. I believe, I believe we have power. And when we got home, the girls walked out of the, out of the van. They started to walk toward the house and they started screaming, we have Wi-Fi. <laughs> so uh, power came back. Power came back. We got power restored. Thank goodness. They were expecting a few more days. So it came back early. We got lucky. So I'm going to show you guys what we did last night. And then we'll meet you guys back here in a few minutes. And we'll finish this. Tornadoes are the worst ever. Tornado, tornadoes are the worst ever. That's true. I mean, there are probably other things that are worse. But oh, for us. For us, it wasn't fun. But anyway, we'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, it is day two of our power outage. And we are headed out to have some fun with our grandkids. Bowling! Bowling. You guys, I don't know if we've ever taken you guys bowling with us before. But anyways, day two, haven't had a shower. We're still waiting for Gabby. No charging of any batteries, no downloading of footage. Like, I do not know how long this is gonna last. We were able to talk to we were able to talk to the hydro guy. He's pulling around in our driveway right here. We were able to talk to him. What did he say, Sam? Tell us. Tell he us. Said, uh, it's a bigger problem than he thought. They saw it. Yeah, and they're trying to figure out what the problem is. They so. still don't even know what the problem is. Where? The, there's three wires on there, and we're the center wire that's not working. There's three <laughs> wires, and we're the lucky ones that aren't working. So they might move us over to the ones that are working. Okay, move us. So he said it won't be two more days. He said it won't be two more days. All I care is that like I wake up to power. That's it. That's all I care. What do you guys think? We wake up to power? Yeah. All right, let's pray. If we, if we don't um if we don't get power, then I'm gonna sue the place. <laughs> yeah. Nana's place? I'm gonna no. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna sue the people who are trying to fix it. I don't know I'm who she start. takes after. I'm gonna after I'm gonna come all Nana. You're gonna come what? No, I said I'm gonna come, come all, um, what's it called? Karen. Right. You're gonna what? Become a Karen. Become a Karen. She's gonna become a Karen. I'm telling you. I'm not gonna become a Karen. Yeah, she's nine. She's nine, you guys. What <laughs> nine is like. Yeah, if we don't get power, if we don't wake up to power in the morning, she's gonna become a Karen and sue. The whole, the, place. the whole place. 
And no offense to anybody with the name of Karen. Anyway, yeah, Gabby is on really finally pretty. on the way. Karen's and a really pretty name. <laughs> yeah, Karen. Karen's are mean. <laughs> what about the Bro Brooklyn's that are mean? Pardon? What about the Brooklyn's that are mean? Uh, the job. We are here at the bowling alley and we're gonna eat, but we only have a few minutes to eat. Our game starts. We're doing rock and bowl or something with music. We have eight minutes. We have eight minutes and so we're gonna eat. Sophie's still figuring out her shoes over there. These are the fancy shoes. They're a bit big. I got a size too big. I thought they fit small, but they don't. Okay, I'm pretty sure you both here, Brooklyn, just yeah. move. I know, but girls are. I know, but sometimes girls just got to do the right thing because you know what boys are like. My shoes don't fit. They don't fit? Let me see. Are they too loose or too tight? Too loose. All right, let me see. Too loose or fine? Uh, too loose or fine. Here. All right. Gabby says they also have a bathroom here, which is really important when we don't have a bathroom at our house. Because we have no hydro um, place than the ones I have. No. This is better than yours, or this no, is? Because they don't have like big and small balls. It's only small. Oh, this is our aisle. It is started. It is started, you guys. We've been driving around, singing songs way too loud because we wanna. Picking up our love friends, fill up the car to live best because we wanna. Who came last? It might have been me. You gotta let the kids win, you guys know. No, you said that you were gonna win. Yeah, I suck at bowling. <laughs> I suck at horseback riding, I suck at bowling, but that's okay, because I have other things that I do well. Just like I all of you guys, too. we all have things that we have an aptitude for and we do well, and it doesn't matter what it is, it just matters that you find that thing and do it. What is happening? It is it party time? Again? Wow. Molly, you on my and bed? So far, I've cheated twice. <laughs> Three queens. <laughs> so far, in Brooklyn. Anymore. Brooklyn, you're a cheater. Look at all uh, my cards. Kings. Two kings. Two kings. Anyway, this is what it looks like. We got Daisy over there on Sophie's bed. Daisy's still here. Yep. Yeah, she's so it's cute. cute. It's nice to have a fire at night, you guys. The rain stopped. It's kind of cold. It's really cold, but. We got a fire going. We got kids hanging out, not on their phones. Yeah? yeah? Look, at fire. Look at that fire, Jacob. It's gorgeous, but we also have so much grass. Look at all the dandelions. We have, like literally have cut the grass seven times in a week. <laughs> and it still just keeps growing. There it is, you guys. The fire for today. Are the cushions there. dry? Are you throwing that in there? I don't. Probably not. Are you throwing that in there? Throw what in there? garbage that's not the garbage that's our s'more stuff that's our kit for s'mores oh if i was like you're gonna do this no i was not going to do that <laughs>
arrived. We have arrived. Oh. Hey, we have arrived. We have. I have no idea where Sam brought us. All I know is that it's raining and cold and I'm not dressed for it. How'd that happen? I brought markers. Oh my gosh. Don't show kids to draw on yourself. All right. So where are we, Sam? Well, draw the frog on me. He pro oh. Jacob's gonna fall. He promised us a wagon ride, and that's where we, where, why we came, right? It's fine. I need the exercise. What? We have to walk to the wagon ride. We have to walk to the wagon ride. So We're this. At an old mill. We're at an old mill. Okay, well, I'm gonna walk. All right, you keep going. I'm sure we can catch up. Go. It's actually good though because. When you have a seven-year-old boy, you want to tire him out. We're taking a We're tiring you out. Tiring you out? Yeah. Look okay, at we that. Got, we got a map. All right. Look, a worm. Let's leave the worm there. We came to party all night long. And we don't need no chaperone. We don't need nobody's attention. Yeah, we just want to dance. Look how cute the water is though. Like this is gorgeous here. Sam did good. You did good, Sam. Don't fall in there. So this is the mill. Wow. We came here in winter when the girls were little. See, the water turns the wheel. And the wheel makes the blade go up and down. So they're using water power to cut wood. Looks like it's gonna take forever. It is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous here. Water is so mesmerizing. Wow, so nice. Do you like it? I took some really good photos. Good. We found the we found the horses, guys. We found them. Bays, big beautiful bays. So this is the old schoolhouse. Do you guys know that this is what old schoolhouses look like? And they had like every different age kids, and everybody just did different work. Want to sit down in the school? Sure. Let's go. go. All right. I'll be the teacher. Okay, here's the spanking stick. Jacob, come up here. You've been bad. In the corner. Where's the dunce hat? Put your hands out. <laughs> now, go back and do your work and be quiet. Okay, touch my view. Don't touch anything. Why is there wood in there? All right, Brooklyn, please come up here and read in front of the class. Yeah, we will. Come stand here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he hates school. Okay, Brooklyn, could you show them math, please? Yes. Would you like me to show Five them? times two. Five times two. There's the chalkboard. Is that what your teacher looks like? Yeah, right? that's what the yeah. teacher looks like. Miss Best. Look, that's mm -hmm. what the teacher would look like. So, what do you guys think about the schoolroom? The roof is very. Yeah, close. they usually have like a wood Wait, stove. What? This is what they Oh, yeah, there's the wood stove. Can Look. I ring the bell? Yeah, can yeah I... that's how the teacher called everybody in for recess. Oh God. <laughs> These are like pioneer. Wow. Isn't this where they tie up their horses? Yeah, it's a hitching post. That's what's right. Here comes our wagon ride. Canadians. Beautiful yep. Canadians. These are the nice, beautiful benches. I want a wagon like this. This is so cute. All right, what are their names? Guinness and Coco. Guinness and Coco. We're being pulled by Guinness and Coco. Super cute. When I was growing up, my family had a cottage and our cottage looked a lot like that. It was a log cabin. So that's the homestead right there and this is our fire. It's actually really cute. A barn in the back. I want to go see that. Alright, so 
this is like the old homestead we wanted to see it. It's just like a, but imagine like we lived like pioneers just the last couple of days with no water. We didn't even have an outhouse. No water, no electricity. So this is like a pioneer home. Yeah, it's beautiful. Like the door frame. I, I could do this though. I always think I could do this. Dave's down there, so I'm sure he'll Look, there's the bed. It's literally like one room. <laughs> you feel bad for the kids? That's a tiny bed. Well, they put a mattress on it. <laughs> that tiny bed would usually be in the kitchen so that when they come in to have their dinner, that's cool. Yeah. So from the bottom, I'll, I'll just scoot in. Whoa, hold on the here. The bottom was made of rope. And every night, have you heard that little verse, sleep tight tonight? Mm -hmm. Well, when long ago, they had to pull all of these really tight at night, all the way down. And then they'd put a stick in there to hold it. So they wouldn't be down close to the floor where it was cold. And then they would put a feather tick on top of the ropes. Okay. And then they would put a heavy quilt on. These quilts, this quilt is over 100 years old. Wow. And they were it made... It does feel 100 years old. <laughs> it does yeah. feel 100 years old. <laughs> and that, that was made out of pieces of, of their clothing. Because, wow. Because anything that wasn't yeah. worn out with a hole in it, they kept it. You don't waste anything. They did not waste anything. That is cool. Well, I love the homestead. And then... Brooklyn's loving this. And even Jacob, he's asking. Oh, that's the sugar shack? So what do you make what do you make in the sugar shack? Sugar. Maple syrup. Oh, this is the woodshed. Wow, they were busy. So that's why they have that bed in the kitchen. Brooklyn, tell them why they have that bed in the kitchen. Because there was no upstairs. What? <laughs> Did you hear the same the, the same thing that I heard? What? Didn't she say that because they work so hard that when they come in to eat at lunchtime they eat and then they lay down and have yeah. a quick nap and then they go back to work? You can read about the stuff, Mom. <laughs> but I loved your answer, Brooklyn. That was cool. You can read about all the syrup shed. Yeah. yeah, so this is the maple syrup shed. Read newspaper. That's where they just keep the fire on the and they boil maple syrup until maple it turns syrup. into sugar. sap and they boil sap until it turns into maple syrup. Yeah, that's it. So this would be their whole homestead, but they usually had like a big barn too. But look, there's an upstairs. We just didn't see it. See, Jacob, look, that's where the bedrooms would be upstairs. Yeah, and the heat rises so you'd be warm up there. It'd be warmer up there. But we're a whole heck of a lot warmer now. Jacob told him we slept in our trailer last night. <laughs> right, so I do not know where we ended up. We left Sam somewhere. I thought we were headed home back to the car But we found this little bridge like the kids love it here. Oh my gosh walk through the water. Uh oh, don't go. Don't go through the water <laughs> It's all mud. Oh I think the bridge is safe. I just saw two people walk over it Don't you know that you're beautiful